Hi, my name is Kevin Fernandez, and welcome to my channel, Gamers Genie. Today, we're going to do an unboxing video on the game Batman the Animated Series Gotham City Under Siege. Now, me and Jordan, we uh, originally played this game at Gen Con a couple years back, and, um, you know, I really enjoyed it. Jordan, not so much, but I, I grew up watching Batman the Animated Series. It's, it's been one of my favorite cartoon series that ever hit the uh, t my TV. Uh, I mean, Mark Hamill as the Joker, come on, that's, that's just genius right there. It's pretty awesome. Um, you know, I like the cover of the game. It really just shows you that Batman is the star because he's Batman. So, you know, that's enough talking about the game. Let's crack this nut open, see what's inside. Okay, so here we go, we have our box. As you can see, it's a one to five player game. The 45 to 60 minutes to play. And you need to be 14 to play this game, but I'm gonna let the parents decide how old you need to be to play a game. Uh, that's not really my call. Uh, we, have, we have a nice shot of Gotham City, um, the bat signal, and of course, Batman himself. So we're gonna flip this over to the back because there's not that much left to talk about it. Show some of the components that's gonna be in the game on the back. We're gonna take our X-Acto knife. We're gonna start cutting. The plastic, not the game. I'm not going to cut the game. There we go. I'm going to take the plastic off. I'm going to lift up the lid. Oh yeah, that glare kind of goes away. And here we go. We got our rule book. Various rules. And stuff we need in there. We're going to move that off to the side. I'm going to just take everything out and we're going to put things in as we go along. Because it'll be easier. So we're going to start here with this customized, I'm going to say dice bag, because we have a lot of dice, and it's really nice material and everything. You got the Batman trademark, Gotham City Under Siege. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take the dice, because we have the dice bag, and we got different colors. We've got purple, we have got blue, green, red, and yellow. And we're going to take all that and we're going to put this in the bag. I, it, because then it reduces the number of plastic bags I have in here. I'm going to keep that in there. I'm going to put that with the rest. Next, we have our punchables. So I'm going to take this out. Forgive that they're off camera. I just want to make sure I get everything off. We're going to start by our Gotham City track. I'm going to punch that out. Put it in the box. Then we're going to punch out our character tokens. We've got Batgirl, we've got Robin, Batman, Catwoman. We've got James Gordon, the Bat Signal, and eh, it looks like a terrified uh, citizen. She lives in Gotham City, so she's uh, justified to be terrified. We have our Act Leader token as well. And we're going to put those in there. Next, we got the different stuff. We have thugs, and they're only one. So they're like the weakest, I would assume. It's been a while. I did play this game once at Gen Con, but um, it was like two years ago. So, you know, I haven't really played the game since then. So, But I wanted to get it when we were at Gen Con. Um, since Jordan's not that big of a fan of Batman, uh, she... Uh, I didn't get it at the time. Plus, I had a, sm a tighter budget at the time, too. Well, we got to the henchmen now after my uh, prattling. We got henchmen. I'm going to store these all in a bag or something at some point. Um, we're going to put those there. And we got the ninjas. 
Because what's a Batman game without ninjas? We're going to put that down below. And we're going to punch out more thugs. Got a lot of punchables to punch out. I know it's not the... It's not the glamorous thing you can see in an unboxing video, but hey, you know, it's a thing. It's, uh, it's something, right, you know? I like how they take the artwork on these things, and they basically put uh, the animated series artwork. Um, don't worry, when I get to the cards, I'm going to show, uh, I'm going to try to get a close-up on those, so that way you guys can see them all in their glory. And this is our last sheet of thugs, henchmen, and ninjas. Actually, um, I'll try to figure this out. This, is, this looks like it'd be a good spot for that. And then I'll put the Batman bag here. Next, let's see, what do I want to do next? Okay, so these are bigger, so I'm going to, oops, forgot some henchmen and some ninjas. I'll figure out how to pack everything all nice and neat. But until then, I'll just keep this stuff at the bottom, and the dice bag will be up on top. Hopefully that is a dice, this is a dice bag. I'm just going off of my very, very limited memory of this game. Um, it's not that this game was not a memorable game, it's just it was... Okay. It's just that it was a long time ago. So here's some... Now here's where the memory's starting to fade. I want to say these are goals for the villains to accomplish, different arcs in the story. Here's the character cards. We got Batgirl. We got Batman, Catwoman, Commissioner Gordon, and the GCPD. And we got Robin. Last time we played this, Jordan was Batman, and I was Robin. But I think we we did offer for her to be. Um, so yeah, I think I'm gonna just bring this down to size. So I'm gonna do the smallest things last. Oh gosh. Oh, found it. I'm glad that these are all easy to open because um, got not so fast bats and the Joker's gotten away in their street justice. We got another Batgirl card. Don't really know what's the difference between the two. But it's interesting. I'll find out. So then, um, oh wait, we're going to we're going in a specific order here. So then I got my cards here, and I'm gonna open these up. Oh, rats! There we go. There we go. And there. It's always nice. We got our nice cards with the great artwork. Because it's, you know, Batman the Animated Series artwork. You know, it really reminds you of your childhood. If you grew up with this show. If you haven't, then I do recommend that you, you know, see it. You can watch it on several areas. The devious plot. Harley Quinn on it. And there's some Act 2 cards I have that I'm going to add in here. It's a, it's a devious plot, but it's a different artwork. These are promo cards we got when we were at Gen Con, and I'm just going to add those right in there. Criminals Run Wild. Villainous Gadget. We got Two-Face Dilemma. Street Justice. Oh, I'll add that in there. And we'll put the not so fast bats on the top. We got burn it down. A lot of arson. A lot of different crimes because they're criminals. The craziest people Gotham has to offer. All right. 
double trouble. So the double trouble was Batgirl. Like all this is Batgirl stuff. And then this is Batman. These are Batman specific cards, so this is his own unique character deck. From the color of this, I would say this is Gordon. Yeah, Gordon. We got Gordon. And here's Robin. Okay. I'm going to seriously find out how to pack this better. Okay, so here's the bot. This is the bottom parts of the buildings. If they get blown up, this is what you. Re I know. I remember. This is what you reveal um, when they get blown up. You. This is what they're supposed to look like. Then you flip them over, and this is what it looks like when uh, a villain destroys a building. Okay, here we go. Here's the masterminds. You got Poison Ivy, Mr. Freeze, the Clock King, you got the Red Claw, the Sewer King, Killer Croc, Jarvis Tetch, aka the Mad Hatter, Man Bat, got uh, Calendar Girl? Yep, Calendar Girl. And yes, these are all actual villains. It's worth the Google. Harley Quinn, Clayface, and Bane. And I'm going to put these because they're so small, I'm going to put them right here. And then here's our nefarious buildings, various our various buildings, some assembly required, and I will assemble these at some point. And I'll figure out how to fit pack that all in there. Hopefully they have something in the rule book on that. So put that there. Then we'll take our Gotham City Under Siege rule book. And we'll place the lid right on top. Oh, oopsies. I almost forgot something. It's like watching paint dry. Okay, I have our, our miniatures. So this is Commissioner Gordon in the GCPD. This one is Robin, because he's got the R. Oops, I forgot to do the close-ups on the cards. Dang it, I hope you all forgive me. Catwoman, Batman, and Batgirl. And I'm going to put these back in the bag because I don't want anything to happen. So, I'm going to put that all back in the bag. I'm going to tuck this away in here. We're going to put the rule book over. We're going to put that there. And there we go. Gotham City Under Siege. Well, there you have it. There's everything inside Batman the Animated Series, Gotham City Under Siege. Uh, as usual, we are going to make a how to play video on this at some point eventually. Um, if you want me to fast track that and get to that as soon as possible, put that down in the comments below. But we do need to film our how to play video on Rise of Tribes because that was a poll that we did and so we want to make sure that we get to that as well. But if you want to know if you have a specific person in mind you want to host this, me or Jordan, put that down in the comments below as well. If you enjoyed this uh, unboxing video, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and ring the notification bell to be notified when we release that how to play video on Gotham City Under Siege. Be on the lookout for it, but until then, thanks for the views.